Miri here. Welcome back to my channel. I have had the pleasure of um, getting sent some products from a new line called Flower by Drew Barrymore. So um, I actually wanted to share that with you today and what I got and uh, maybe do a kind of like a little bit of... Um, actually, I'll probably put some mascara on because I look like a scary person right now. Um, and with their new mascara is um, supposedly really really good so let's start with that um, this is the lash warrior mascara in fiercest black and then I'm just gonna open it and do my mascara real quick because literally I look scary <laughs> without mascara <laughs> Um, yeah, I have those like eyelash. I mean, I have a lot of eyelashes and I just have those that stick out straight and you can't really see it unless I'm wearing mascara, which is like whatever, but you know, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a little bit of mascara. I probably should have a mirror here. You know what? So I put a little bit of mascara. And if you're anything like me, you are not the best when it comes to putting on mascara because then you get dirty, which is me all the time. <laughs> me all the time. But anyways, okay, so here is the mascara. I can tell you right now that um, it does separate the lashes a lot. So separation, you see it um, lift. You see much better. I actually do like this mascara. I'm really picky when it comes to mascara. Maybelline's my favorite, um, but this one is really good too. Maybelline and the one from Christopher Buckle are my favorite right now, and um, I guess this, we can add number three to the list here. I like it. So there you go. And I'll do a little bit of the bottom. Just to pop. So this is Lash Warrior. Pierce is black. <laughs> Posing for the camera, as you can see. Okay, so next is their um, flower shimmer and shade eyeshadow palette in intense natural ES4. So basically, these are the colors. Let's see if I can like dim out the. I'm just gonna open it so that glare doesn't ruin everything. There it is. And here's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. And I guess like maybe we can um, pretty much swatch it a little bit. That was the um, number six. That was number six. So they're numbered. They don't really have a, um, they don't really have a name for them, but like, I mean, the pigmentation is great. I guess we'll just try number seven. Wow. Wow. I really like this palette right now. Um, normally, you know, some palettes don't have pigmentation like this, but this is actually really impressive. So, 
And there you go. And it comes with its own little brush. It says flower on it. So, I mean, I cannot wait to use this for a look. Maybe I'll use it now in a upcoming um, look. Okay, so now we have their glossy gel eyeliners. And they actually sent me two glossy gel eyeliners. No, three. Four. Five. So they sent me five glossy gel eyeliners. Um, this is the their longwear formula, so it's supposed to last. This is Silver Fox, so it's like a grayish. It's supposed to have a lacquered finish. So then we have um, Galaxy, which I'm guessing is like a bluish black color. Then we have Serpent, which is looks like a little greenish black color. Then we have um, the black vinyl, which I'm guessing is super black. <laughs> and then we have purple quartz, which is a black um, color. And um, yeah, these are amazing. I can't wait to actually, I'm going to open the black vinyl and kind of see where that takes me. We're just seeing where this takes me today right now. All right, so this is the, the black vinyl and I'm going to just go ahead and, oh, there it is. Why not like open all of them? <laughs> Why not open all of the eyeliners? I am going to open all of the eyeliners um, right now, but I am not going to open all of the tattoo effect brow stains. And I'll show you how many I got and what colors I got and why I'm not opening all of them today. So this is a purple, so this has like a purple glitter. I can't see if, I don't know if you guys can see that. It has a purple glitter. So it's black, purple, glittery. Um, I guess I can use that for some sort of like purple look that I want to intensify um, which I just did by the way well it was like a blue purple blue or whatever a few videos back I did that and this one is just a green that has a little bit of a shimmer Then we go on to the Silver Fox, which I'm guessing is gonna be a silver type of shimmer. Yep, yeah, it is, it's a silver type of shimmer. And then the Galaxy, which I'm assuming is going to be like a purplish shimmer. just a black shimmer so the black one was just black and then the galaxy is a black shimmery color and last but not least the bronzed out which is a brown I'm guessing brown um, shimmer liner yep and that is it a brown shimmer liner so now you see all of those and now I'm going to move on to the tattoo effect brow stain. I got one, two, three, four, and five. And I'm gonna tell you why I'm not gonna open these, except for probably this one. Okay, so I'll probably just open this one since it's the espresso, which is the, um, darkest one because if you notice i have really dark hair and really dark eyebrows which means that these here will work for me which means that i'm gonna give these away so i'm gonna open this smudge proof 12 hour espresso brow tattoo tint 
Okay, so right away you see that it is a felt tip. Um, and I'm going to swatch it right here. And as, oh, this won't work for me either. So it's a, a an espresso. So these probably won't work for me, but I will tell you right now that I am trying to take it off and it's literally stained. So it, it does what it says and I, I pretty much do this to all of them and they're smudged, like literally I'm doing this and they're like not coming off, like not coming off. So, I mean, right now I'm very, very impressed with the pigmentation of the, um, eyeshadow palette i'm very impressed that they're very smudge proof um the colors are beautiful i just i'm not impressed with the colors for the brow tint i wish they had a darker one but that's okay because i don't use brow stuff either way i like like my natural eyebrows and i just keep them as they are whenever i do makeup sometimes i'll just like kind of extend it with you know, um, eyeshadow or a little bit of an eyeliner. So it doesn't really matter to me. But um, yeah, so that's the flower. I um, I can't guess I want to do a look with them. So, I mean, you can expect that in the next video. So that is all for today. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel and come back soon. Bye, guys.